How's it going guys? Sin Kitsu Gaming here, back again with a brand new video. Before we start off with today's chat talk, I just want to address that we are getting so close to 200 subscribers. It's 10 more guys, 10 more, and I'll make that 200th subscriber special. I might still make an awesome montage, but that depends if you guys like it or not. I don't know. I mean, we'll see that day when it comes. Now let's continue to the chat talk for today. And I'm going to give you guys advice for making gold. Yes, I'm going to make advice for making gold. I've seen a lot of videos for gold farming. I don't know about you guys, but gold farming is actually pretty freaking boring. To do that same thing over and over and over and over and over. But my advice would be doing bounties. So for today, I'm just going to let the gameplay play through with bounties as I'm talking about this advice. The reason why I think it's best to earn gold this way is because you're earning multiple things at the same time as you're doing these bounties. So the three things you earn total by doing these are gold, XP, and bounty tokens. Those are three very important things. However, for the record, um, this advice is only going to apply to people that have multiple accounts that are at a decent level, not too low. And, uh, yeah, and also you guys have to do this daily. You have to do this every day. Just knock out a couple of quests when you're bored. Just like the trailer said, you can play this game at any time, anywhere. On your mobile device, and I mean anywhere. So let's go back on what I said about the multiple accounts. The reason why it is so important is because you'll earn more bounty tokens, and you'll also earn more gold. What I do every single day when I come on on Celtic Heroes is that I do bounties for my main accounts, my warrior, and my ranger. I miss out on the two because the other two are not that much luxed up. They do not survive well. <laughs> Let's just keep it at that. So daily, this is what I earn for each regular bounty. This one is the earnings for an elite bounty. And this one is, I think it's, yeah, it's my for my warrior. This is every day for my warrior. This is the elite bounty for my warrior as well. And the next pay is going to be for my ranger. So guys, it may not look that much. However, remember, this is every day that we're going to do this. Every day, you're doing it on multiple accounts and you're earning that much money each day of the week. So I'm going to show you guys on a paper the math for this, okay? Right now, let's find out how much in one week do I earn from all the accounts all together. So this is just a rough estimate on how much I get on each day if I do the bounties from my three accounts. Well, as you can see, at the end of each day, I earn 4.2K gold. So as long as you keep doing these bounties, you'll get that much each day of the week so there is five days in a week, 4.2 times five would be 21K. That means you get 21K each week, most certainly at a stable rate. You'll keep getting this gold each week as long as you keep doing your bounties every time with each of those counts. And this is not counting the extra bounties that you could get with the bounty pledges. Like this is not even counting those and also the elite bounties. So just imagine how much gold you'll get if you get lucky with those elite bounties and many more. As you are earning gold and XP from all the bounties, at the same time, you'll be farming one of those, uh, what do you call those, uh, bounty tokens. The orange ones, green ones, or purple ones. Whichever ones, but either way, if you get 25 of those orange tokens, that means you can trade it in for a purple token, which also means you can get it for a pet, or a battle mount. So guys, invest in these bounty tokens and use them to actually make some money. You know what I mean? You can actually trade them in for a mount token or a pet token and you could put it on auction for a lot of money. It goes for a lot of money, trust me. The decision is all yours to make. So you guys can do whatever you want with those. Either way, you'll be making a lot of money each week as long as you keep doing those bounties. If you hate gold farming because it's so boring and you love quest taking, just go ahead and do this. Just do this. It would work for you because uh, this not only earns you gold, it earns you XP, uh, hunter tokens, and many other things. Just be sure to do it. I mean, this is what I do every single day. I mean, I get bored in school and I start doing those quests. 
eventually I get a lot of gold at the end of the week. And this is just a gradual amount each time, just as long as you keep on doing it. In conclusion, in my opinion, I think this is the best way to earn gold because it earns you multiple things at the same time. So closing this video, I hope you guys really enjoyed watching today. Um, I hope it helped a lot because when I look up how to get gold, it's always the same thing. And I think this is just brand new. Maybe someone wants to try it. Maybe someone is already doing it. Who knows? Either way, I'm giving a good reminder or just throwing it out there for you guys to try it out. So, hope you guys have a wonderful day and peace out.